This video will demonstrate how to play audio files from a phone, tablet or MP3 player on the Rockville PA speakers via Bluetooth. The Rockville PA speaker consists of two speakers. The speaker on the left is the powered speaker. Powered means it's either supplied power from a battery or from an electrical outlet. The cord plugs in on the lower right hand side of the back panel of the left speaker. The speaker on the right side of the pair is a non-powered speaker, and it gets its input from the powered speaker. Caution! All connections to the speaker should be made with the speaker off. To connect the non-powered speaker with the powered speaker, a 1 quarter inch to 1 quarter inch cable is used. This cable is usually stored, coiled up and stuffed into one of the handles on the non-powered speaker. With the powered speaker turned off connect one end of the cable to the speaker in connection on the non-powered speaker, and the other end of the cable to the speaker out connection. Before the powered speaker's electrical plug is inserted into an electrical outlet, ensure that the powered speaker power switch item 1 is in the off position. Also ensure that the MP3 line volume and master volume knobs are mid-range. When the Rockville PA speakers are turned on this the LCD screen looks like this. To pair a phone, tablet or MP3 player with the Rockville PA speakers, the mode must be changed to Bluetooth. Looking at the back panel of the powered speaker, only certain controls and indicators are used when pairing a phone, tablet or MP3 player with the Rockville PA speakers via Bluetooth. Ensure item A, the MP3 line selector button is selected to MP3. Item B, the mode button, selects the mode of the Rockville PA speakers. The modes are FM radio, Bluetooth, USB and SD item. The LCD screen shows the current mode. Item D is the volume control. Item E is the clip indicator. Item F is the bass and treble controls. Item G is the MP3 line volume control. Push the mode button nominally twice to change the LCD screen to Bluetooth. Notice that it says disconnected, meaning that no one is now presently connected to the PA speakers. If the LCD screen reads, Bluetooth connected the Rockville PA speakers have paired with a previously connected phone, tablet or MP3 player. This problem will be addressed later in this video. To play audio from a phone, tablet or MP3 player, that phone, tablet or MP3 player, must be paired with the Rockville PA speakers. Using an iPad the pairing process will be demonstrated. On the iPad go to settings then Bluetooth. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen and Rockville should be listed in other devices. To pair, touch Rockville. This will initiate the pairing process which takes a matter of seconds. Rockville will show connected on the iPad under my devices. The LCD screen will also show connected. Let's play some music. Select Apple Music. Select Sing. Select Sing the Hits. Select Rollin' in the Deep by Adele. There's a fire starting in my heart Reaching a fever pitch and it's bringing me out the dark Finally I can see you crystal clear Item G, the MP3 line volume control and Item D, the volume control is used in conjunction with the phone, tablet, or MP3 player's volume controls. When changing the output volume of the Rockville PA speakers observe item E, the clip indicator. If the clip indicator blinks red or the output sound is distorted, turn the volume down until the clip indicator stops blinking or the distortion stops. Item F is the treble and bass controls for the output volume. These settings can also be controlled on the phone, tablet or MP3 player. If when BT mode was entered, the LCD display read Bluetooth connected, this prevents pairing with the Rockville PA speakers. The most likely cause is that a member of your audience had previously paired with the Rockville PA speakers, and their device and the Rockville PA speakers have repaired. The Rockville PA speakers allow only one Bluetooth connection at a time. The path to solve this problem is to ask the audience if anyone has ever paired with the Rockville PA speakers prior to the event. If so, any audience members should go to their Bluetooth page and see if Rockville is connected. If an audience member finds they are paired, they should touch the circle eye alongside the connected Rockville. Touching the circle eye will reveal two options. One option is disconnect, and the other option is forget this device. Because of the occasional quirks of Bluetooth pairing, the better option is to use the forget this device option. Click on forget this device. Clicking on forget this device brings up a confirmation box at the bottom of the screen, 
the confirmation box will say, Forget Rockville. Click on Forget Device. These action removes Rockville PA speakers from the audience member's device. Check the LCD screen to see if it reads Bluetooth disconnected pairing of your device should work now.